Hey y'all, welcome back to another video. So today I'm gonna to be trying on some clothes again. Um, just showing you what I got from Marshall's, Kohl's, and Maurice's I think is all of it. Um, I think maybe I have one or two things from a couple other places that maybe we'll throw in, I don't know. Um, but we're at least gonna do those. Um, I got these like a little bit ago, so I just wanted to show you what I'm adding to my wardrobe that we're checking out. Uh, yeah, and I think uh, we'll start with Marshall's. I only have a few things. Uh, and I can just show you what we're doing to kind of like convert the wardrobe since, you know, I had to get rid of a lot of stuff. So now we're trying to fill in some gaps with uh, some new stuff. Um, and some of the stuff I bought, like I said, a little bit ago, uh, that was like fall kind of, fall, winter, um, like clearance stuff. So it's like probably not available anymore. And also like maybe not the springiest clothes in the world. So <laughs> anyway, let's get started. Okay, first up I got this kind of men's like polo shirt vibe. Um, it comes over here, it's kind of like bowling shirt. I like that it's got like a little zipper here so I can do a little sexy cleavage if I want to or I can, you know, just be like conservative about it <laughs> if you want to. Um, I like it, I think it looks nice. Uh, it's really comfortable, a little warping I guess, you know, around this area, but what are you gonna do? That's kind of just what's happening there. Um, this is a men's shirt, I got like a men's small. Um, which normally, uh, I like men's clothing. Like I, I would like to wear more men's clothing, I think just cause I feel like gender with clothing is dumb. Generally, if it fits, it looks nice and you like it like cool beans. Um, but men's clothing is often not very soft. I am really big into soft, uh, for clothing and I like go around and I'll feel stuff <laughs> at the store to see if I think it's soft enough for me, if I'm interested. And oftentimes it's just sandpaper when I feel men's clothes and I'm like, why is it so not soft? And then also a lot of times I think men's, men's clothes are kind of ugly as far as like w what I would want to wear. So then I'm like, why is it not soft and it's ugly? <laughs> like it should give them something. But anyway, um, yeah, I think this is cute. Uh, I think this one is blue. Um, it's like kind of hard to tell, but it's like more of like a navy color. And then uh, I also got the same one in black. So I'll show you that really fast. Um, but yeah, I like them. I think they're nice. All right, here we got it in the black. Same kind of vibe, same kind of deal. I think this will look cute, like tucked in to some, like a skirt or, or uh, some jeans or something. Uh, I tend to tuck my stuff in so that my waist is like at a more appropriate height for me. <laughs> um, but yeah, I think it looks good. Uh, like I said, comfy. And uh, I'm digging it, I like it. The only other thing I got from Marshalls was this like cropped like polo um, action going on. Uh, I like the pattern on it. I think it's pretty cute. And uh, it kind of looks like, uh, what's it called? Like the shining pattern <laughs> a little bit, which I think is fun. Um, but yeah, I like a good crop. I think it looks good. Uh, it's a good like length for me for a crop. Um, and, uh, you know, I would love a good v-neck. I think I might have to iron down the collar because it does come on a pickup kind of behind here, but that's also where the tag is. So maybe like the purchase tag. Um, so maybe that being gone will help. I don't know. Um, I think it looks good. I think it looks cute. I feel very cute. I like it a lot. Uh, that's it for Marshalls. So now I'll switch over to what I got from Kohl's, which is also like not a ton of stuff. None of this is like a ton of stuff. Um, but what I got from Kohl's and then I'll do Maurice's. Ray. Okay, before I switch fully over out of um, this top, I got these pants from Kohl's. They're like these long, um, they're like faux kind of jean looking, uh, like stretchy pants, like kind of, they're very soft. Uh, kind of like, not cargo pants, but a little bit. There's a lot of cargo pants going on right now. <laughs> That's like the trend. Um, this is more like kind of linen maybe almost, but it's really soft. So not like kind of scratchy linen. Um, but I think they're nice. I like the color, the like light, very light blue wash on them. They got pockets. They're like a zero X. So they like, I fit pretty good in the waist. You know, I'm not feeling like they're going to not fit me in just a minute. Uh, and I think they look good. Um, I would wear it with this probably. Um, but I think it looks nice. Uh, no complaints, no problems. Digging it. I also got all of this stuff on clearance from Kohl's, I'm pretty sure. Uh, and everything else I have is a dress. So here's the first one out here. Oh, no, no pockets on her, but a uh, nice long sleeve, a little bit of like scalloping kind of, not let scallop, like lettuce, <laughs> I think is how they describe that. A little lettucing uh, on there and up here. Um, 
And then there's like uh, stripe, not pattern, but um, kind of the way that the, I guess, knit is. It's like stripey. Uh, and I really like the color. I like this green on me. It's got some like darting here on the skirt to like come out a little bit. I don't think it really moves that much, but there you go. Um, I like it. It's so soft. <laughs> it's super comfortable. I think it's a really pretty color on me. Uh, I think it's a really good like winter dress uh, that it's not like maybe maybe fall even. It's not super warm. I wouldn't say it's not really like thick material, but it's very soft. And you know because of high neck, hot you know long arms. Um, I think probably better for like warmer months, fall, winter. Um, but I like it a lot. Super comfy and just easy. Like I'm wearing an outfit now. We did it. <laughs> Which, well, one of my favorite things about dresses is just and now I have an outfit on. Hooray, we're done. Okay, I'm gonna be honest. Does this fit me incredibly? No. Um, I do think it fits pretty good in the in the body here. Um, it's like up to here on my knee. It's hard to tell maybe with the leggings. Um, it's the on the chest does that fit like amazing no um but fits me everywhere else pretty well i like these little like details i like the little lace bit here it's got a little bit of like high uh shoulder here a seam on the arm um and i think once my i get my reduction this is gonna look super good on me and um right now it looks you know it doesn't look bad um it's super soft and I sort of want to just, a little part of me just wants to be Morticia Adams. And I feel very Morticia Adams with this. And I feel very cute, little black dress, but like with some flair and fun. So uh, yeah, I like it. Um, and I think it's only going to fit better soon. So fingers crossed that it, it will look even nicer on me, you know, in the near future. Okay. I got this white kind of shift dress. Um, I'm actually a little bit lost on um, why I bought this. Um, I think it's cute, but I also, like, clearly the bust is not great, and I'm assuming I was like, oh, after my reduction, we'll be good. But I also just, like, I think it's okay. I don't love it. Um, so I'm not sure I'm gonna keep it, and I'm pretty sure I'm past returning it, so I might just donate it, because I'm like, it looks cute. I don't dislike it. it. It fits really well here, and that's probably part of why I thought it was, I was like, oh, well, it fits really well in the waist, but... I kind of feel like it's just not really giving me a lot. And um, I am getting to the point where I'm like, as much as I want to buy clothing right now, I'm really trying to prevent myself from doing so because I'm still trying to lose 20 pounds and then I'm gonna get a breast reduction, hopefully. And so both of those things are not conducive to me, you know, to like invest in clothes right now. So every time I see something that's like really cute, I'm really trying to be like, just don't buy clothes right now, it's okay. <laughs> Which I'm saying, these, these I bought a little bit ago. Um, but uh, yeah, I also think I'm being a little more discerning about like, oh, I don't just like it and it fits well, so I'll buy it. That it's, uh, I wanna be like, oh, but do I have something similar? Or could I get a better version of this if I just wait a little bit and it'll fit me better and I'll be happier with it. Um, so I think this one's actually gonna go, even though I don't think it looks bad. I just think um, probably once I'm, I know what my size is gonna be, I'm gonna be able to find something like this, but that'll be like, really good and perfect for that time so you know i don't know <laughs> this is why you try them on and check whereas this one i love this i think it fits really well uh it's really soft i like the pattern i don't love the color but it fits so beautifully i feel so pretty i feel so comfortable i love her <laughs> this is like it's a really good for you know for my chest it's like a really good fit generally which often is not the case for dresses like this and um yeah i just feel really like flowy and comfy and spinny in this um which is generally how i want to feel in a dress so nice um I might wear this tomorrow, it's so pretty. <laughs> and I did, yeah, I don't think the color is the best on me, but I also just look so cute that I was like, well, you know, I, I think it's still worth it and I think it still looks really nice and I feel like I'm living my hippie fantasies. So, <laughs> and Morticia Adams and also 70s hippies fantasies. So we're just all over the place with the, <laughs> the wardrobe and that's fine. Okay, and then to start off the Marisa segment, this was the last thing from Kohl's, uh, I got these boots on. These cowboy looking kind of rattlesnake boots. I'm sure you cannot see those very well. I'll take them off in a second to show you. Um, but I uh, thought they would look nice with this outfit. I don't know, I wouldn't wear it with this dress, I guess. Um, but uh, 
Yeah, not too bad. The comfortable. I'm not sure how much uh, they're gonna go with my. <laughs> it sounds like I have spurs on right now because of the <laughs> tag and the like string between them. I left. Um, I'm not sure how much use I'll get out of these. They are comfortable though, um, and you know. I don't, I don't hate them. So yeah, sure. <laughs> we'll keep them. I definitely bought them on clearance because I would probably not buy these normally. Um, and that's how they get you. They just make them so cheap. Uh, let me take them off real quick so I can show you. <laughs> these kind of like, yeah, it's like snake skin, um, boots, uh, looking vibe. And then um, it's just kind of like, you know, multitude of browns here. They have the pointy toe. So they kind of look cowboy-y. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm not sure what I'm gonna wear these with, but uh, I'll find a way. I think they're cute and uh, they're comfy, so we'll figure it out. Okay, I got this green, like velvety blazer that I think is already too big for me. Um, I'm also just like, it's not very comfy and it's very lightweight in like a very cheap feeling way. So I think this is gonna go. Um, like the concept is cute, but I think, uh, and it's like kind of not fitting me great in the like shoulder and arm area. I feel like the arms are like, not quite long enough. I don't know. Um, not my fave, so we're gonna pass. This is the, that's a no for me, dog. So she's gotta go. But you know, you win some, you lose some on the clearance. <laughs> All right, another outerwear piece I got from Maurice's. We got this like burnt orange, kind of red um, jacket going on. We got pockets in here. Um, buttons up for us for cold. It is maybe a little big on me, but I don't mind that when I want like cozy stuff, you know, because I'm gonna probably wear like a sweater or something under it that's got some bulk too, potentially. Um, so I think it fits good, I like it. Um, and it's like pretty comfortable, uh, but I got, I have to like actually buying like shackets now, like I would say this is more of like a shacket than like, you know, flannel, uh, cause it's thicker. Um, I have to buy shackets now because uh, I used to like revolve buying my clothing around like I'm often uh, very warm, like overheated. Um, and then now that I've lost like 60 pounds, I have like skinny person disease <laughs> where I'm cold all the time, um, except for I'm still warm all the time. Now I'm just cold at my extremities and warm near my core because I guess I have bad circulation, but it still means that I'm often cold now and my wardrobe is not prepared for that. Uh, for me to just constantly be cold. Um, so we needed to buy some stuff that's gonna give us some some warmth. Like this is comfortable right now, which normally I feel like I would have been like, this is already making me too hot. So <laughs> it's good news that we've got this. We like it. She's cute. I think the, the colors are really nice on the plaid. Uh, that would look nice. So great. Okay, obviously wouldn't wear this this way. Um, but uh, I don't have any vests, and I thought it might be nice to have like a warm vest. Um, definitely is not happy about <laughs> my bust there. Um, I do think it's pretty cute. I like the pattern on here is like kind of like a hound's tooth, like, but like it's like a zigzaggy pattern instead. Um, and then it's got the like kind of plaid lines running through of like kind of like a uh, tweedish kind of pattern that I really like. Um, I do think it's comfy and I like that it's pockets. It's like pretty soft, but it feels pretty warm. I'm gonna keep it. Um, I'm not sure I'm gonna style it yet because I've just not really had vests before um, in this way. But uh, you know, we'll try it out. We'll see how it goes. I'm sure I can find uh, something cute to wear this with. Uh, and I do like it. I think it's really comfortable. It's maybe a little long, but I'm assuming that's supposed to be that way. Um, so yeah, I think I just, like I said, don't have experience with this garment. So we'll try it out. So this dress is why I made this order from Maurice's and I think it's so cute. I like it so much. Um, it's pretty fitted here. It's like, it pulls a little, not a ton. It gives me a little bit of spin, that's nice. Um, but I really like the pattern on this. Uh, you can see on the sleeves. I think it's a really pretty pattern. And I like, uh, it's kind of like harvesty, it's kind of fallish. And I like that the pattern um, is like sheer here on there, but it's also printed here where it's like less sheer. Um, and I just think it looks really pretty. Uh, I feel really cute. I feel like this is very much like a great dress for fall, winter kind of vibes, but that I could wear kind of whatever. Um, it's a little dark maybe to wear <laughs> in the spring, but I also don't care. Uh, I might wear it soon just because I feel really cute and I like it a lot. And I feel like uh, it's still pretty, it's fitted pretty well, but it'll probably still fit me um, once I lose a little bit more weight and still fit me once uh, 
we got a different bust size going on. So nice. All right, we got two items here. Um, this top that's kind of got like a velvety like brocade on it, and then this skirt. You know, tuck in the top. Um, this skirt that's like uh, like a satiny silky skirt with a little uh, slit on it. Um, I do really like this top. I don't love the neck, um, but I uh, really like the like velvety brocade it's got going on in there. It's pretty soft, even though it's got like kind of velvety accents going on. Um, I think it looks nice. Uh, it wouldn't be like an everyday <laughs> top that I would probably wear, but especially, if, like I said, for like fall, winter, I think this would be quite nice. Um, and it does give me like some Victorian vibes, which I do like. <laughs> I do think Victorian vibes are quite fun. Um, the skirt I really like. Um, it is like a little loose actually in the waist, which I'm surprised because it's a large. Um, but uh, I do really like these kind of satiny like skirts that are just straight. Um, I like the little slit in there. I think it's really pretty. I look very Christmassy <laughs> right now with these colors. Um, but I think it looks really nice. I think uh, I can get use out of both of these. And um, I'm, I'm gonna probably get some more like satiny skirts once I know what size I'm gonna be. Um, but uh, it was nice to be able to snag this one that I like and like is comfortable and fits right now. So fun. Okay, this feels slightly anticlimactic to be the last thing, I guess. Um, but I got these pants that, oh gosh, they're so soft. They're so nice and soft. Uh, they got like some seams running through here. They're definitely just kind of like run errands, loungy pants, they got pockets. Um, but they're so soft, they're so comfortable. I didn't know they were gonna be this soft. I'm very happy <laughs> that they are. It's like a nice like pumpkin-y orange which, uh, you know, for my general aesthetic is good. Uh, and especially like I've been saying for fall vibes, uh, we love a like pumpkin -y orange. So uh, yeah, happy with that. Um, I'm pretty happy that I guess I'm only uh, getting rid of two things that I got. Um, and yeah, everything else went pretty good. So thanks for joining me today. Get to see some additions to my wardrobe. Hopefully you'll see them soon in vlogs and videos. Um, and uh, yeah. Uh, see you later. Bye.